I've come to meet Dean, a local fisherman, and this is his hut. Look at all these fish. We're hoping to get the first sprats of the season. And they're not here, which is either a, a good sign or a bad sign. Dean Fryer has worked as a fisherman for over 30 years. And each year, he tries to land the first sprats at Oldborough. I'm tagging along and hoping that I bring him some Aussie luck. So is this the start of the sprat season? Uh, should be, but yeah. um, everything's about a month behind this year because that's been pretty mild. <laughs> this like is mild? Is, like it is today, yeah. <laughs> you call this mild? <laughs> yeah, ain't too bad. <laughs> I know not a lot worse. Oh, for an Australian, it's, <laughs> it feels cold. It's a bit. <laughs> so how do you fish it all the time of the year? Yeah, 52 weeks of the year, right. weather permit. Yeah. Are so you going to catch anything for lunch? I hope so. Yeah, <laughs> I hope so too. That's what we're here for. Yeah. It's sprats we want to catch, and then I'm going to cook them up for lunch. <laughs> I would want to break down out here. It's so cold. Oh. So you do this twice a day? Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. I don't think I could ever be a British fisherman. I mean, I've been out in, in prawn boats off the coast of Cairns, and it's tranquil and tropical and warm, and you float out there at four in the morning. This is the middle of the day and it's bitter. Oh look, fish. But sadly, it's not a sprat. What is this? Uh, a whiting. Better luck next time. Oh, look at that. What's that? That's a cod. Like sprats, cod also likes icy waters. So landing some should be a good sign. Can't believe the size of these cod. We do get them double that size in the winter. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, look at that. Incredible looking thing when they're like this. The fish are sorted as they're landed, but the sprat bucket remains empty, so I guess the waters just aren't cold enough yet. We need, like, three weeks of really cold weather. Right. And this isn't cold. This ain't cold at all. Let me take my fish and chips for granted again. Oh. How do you smoke a gut fish? It's a pretty good skill. It's tradition for the fisherman who lands the first sprat of the season to rush it up to the pub, and locals have gathered in anticipation.